thousand dollars a week sounds fair to me. A hundred thousand. I cannot do a hundred thousand dollars. You? What happened to you? Your legs. A bullet clipped my spinal cord. So, these people you anger came after you, and now you live like this, stuck in a chair. I don't want to feel just anything. Making threats. Trying to tell him this is the cost of what it is. Oh, he threatened that bitch. He trying to. You know what he's trying to do. I might be able to get 50,000 approved by the Moon Age of Two. You're going to have to give me a few days to get the green light. Go with that boy. You can take a few days. To get him 50. I feel like that bitch is making a light threat. Like. But her brother Fisher knows somebody from Scully's crew. Mm -hmm. And he told me Scully was shot, but he ain't dead. Just real, real mad. I bet. You doing that shit right now? <sighs> Damn, oh, no motherfucking doc. I'm gonna do this shit myself. Go give me a knife. <sighs> This motherfucker is a fucking psycho. Savage. God damn. Fuck. Ah, shit. Give me the fucking whiskey. Oh, no. Nigga. You need to go to the doctor, B. That's a little bit too much blood, B. Oh, yeah. No, do I look fucking good? Oh, oh, you see that shit just oozing out like when he talked? That shit. Ooh. He said. Motherfucker. He said. I'm gonna stone this bitch ass. I'm gonna stone you to a piece of shit on the concrete. Ooh. He's scared now. How we doing for security? Coming down from Oakland. You ready in the day? Peace is healing. And he's saying again, we need to head to Scully, I know. But we're not ready yet. Let your people get down here. You letting them bit patch up and shit? You should have down. Word, like you just was... went straight up in there. Been hitting me too. He wants his weekly payment. I think we got to make a shit work about right. Call him. Tell him on me. Business as usual. You about to work with the police, nigga? Now get him to do something, to Scully. Mm. Fuck with that crazy I was thinking maybe you and your Englewood PD friends can help me out. I'd of course throw in a bonus. Ten grand each. Twenty. And I'll look into it. Alright. But I've got my own pressures too. Forty eight hours. Moth is gone. How you feel about that? Is. What? Franklin asking him to do what he's doing. I don't feel like about that shit. <laughs> Dirty cop. They gonna get that motherfucker killed. That's what it is. It, 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 yeah. They already, he's CIA. Franklin CIA. He might have <laughs> shit anyway. <laughs> nah. Man, he that nigga boss. Uh, what's the dad do? Uh, he runs uh, a shelter, mostly for recovering addicts, homeless. His son's a drug dealer and he runs a shelter. What's up with that? I don't. He don't be having a boy. They're using offshore companies? What 21 year old kid does that? 21? Mm. <laughs> there we go. Uh, ooh. Clapping them cheeks tonight. So I was just thinking, maybe we don't need the cocaine business at all. What? We just dress you up, hire you out for uh, birthday parties and, and bar mitzvahs. Hello, yeah, <laughs> sir. I'll be your manager. My rate is 15%. Chingo de feria. Chingo de feria. 
It says it here. Yeah. That's what he said. Man, this is some horror movie shit, man. Is <laughs> <laughs> that a car in the middle? Hey, homie, I think your cousin fucking with you. Oh, man, nigga trying to get paid. He is getting paid. The jackass, nigga. See? Let them niggas go right there. Uh, uh, talk to him. Bring him here. Where? Yeah, motherfucker, you set the shit up. Go handle it. <laughs> All right. Ain't no pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Slowest walk out. This is some bullshit, bro. <laughs> Hell no, I don't know about this. This don't look right. This is a fucking setup, nigga. Come on. Just fill the ass in the car, nigga. Move. Why you went to the front? <laughs> <laughs> Nah, I heard them niggas cocking some guns. It sounded like as they was walking down. They did have guns, but I could have swore I heard a nigga. Yeah, they had guns. They ain't shoot though. Yeah, but yeah. fuck that, nigga. Y'all yeah, niggas coming man. out of the back. I, mean, I don't man. know these niggas. Nah, I'm good. Fuck Look, that. they got people not just in the front, but up and down the block and on the roof. Oh, yeah. Pick a truck. Two guys inside, stoppers to ram anything that comes even close. I don't even want to guess how much firepower they got. Let's get the fuck out of here. But don't bother us again with this bullshit. Let these animals kill themselves off. Nigga stayed at the joint with the too scared. That's a dope ass spot though. Man, the whole fucking fortress is dope. Yeah. Apartment <laughs> complex. <laughs> bro, that shit. This shit is. Set up for that shit. A word. You see, you see that pickup truck? Ram stopper. He stopped multiple vehicles from getting up in there. Yeah, just. I'm gonna come in there with nothing less than that SWAT truck. Yeah, but the way it was set up, I, there wasn't even no room for the SWAT truck to like get a running Pick start in the bitch. I was at a Berkeley in '68, so you must have known Fred Hampton. I knew him well before he went to Chicago. Did, did we meet back then? Uh, no, I would have remembered you. Uh, listen, I really need to. Yeah. Listen, my uh, my home number's on the back. Mm. I grew up off Crenshaw on 54th. I've been seeing the changes, like you. I want to help. She want to help herself? Or she want to become famous? She want to go viral in the 80s? Mm-hmm. Got something to say to my boy, you tell him yourself. Now go and get out of my place. You and your son got a lot in common. You both seem to think that I won't fuck you up. Uh, Try it! No, no, hang on, hang on. Isn't this interesting? Hello, Officer Nix. Uh, everything okay here? Am I writing a story on police provocation? Just having a little conversation. You want to tell me what that was about? No. The man I've been trying to get to, Paul Davis. He outbid us on the Van Ness and Vermont Harbor properties. He's got influence with city council, police commissioner, and he's raising money for Mayor Bradley. We just made a very big contribution. Too big a contribution, in my opinion. And make no mistake, he's as dirty as they come. And clean enough to sit next to the mayor. Girl, I'm just tripping that he went from trying to get them to move about the crib to now he's in the crib chilling with them eating dinner discussing whatever. Mm. Like he ain't worried about my, my, my man Scully no more. Mm. Life's moving on. I think they trying to figure it out. Get it together. I think that motherfucker's still hanging around though. Why you don't got your strap in your hand? That's my question. Is that also? Oh shit! Told you, fucking threats. That's all that was, nigga. Give me my money. Give it a hundred thousand on the kitchen floor. How much it says? A hundred thousand. Oh Jesus! Cut it off! 
set it on the floor in blood. Right. That's wild. The kid. That's fucking cop, man. They took the kid. Mexican cop. Yeah. <laughs> he went on this shit. That bitch is dirty for that. I Why feel like they... I feel like he killed the old police chief. He probably did. He didn't just... realize how much uh, <laughs> he can help Tijuana out. What? <laughs> With these motherfuckers coming through the way. Like, they went and got a fucking goon as police chief in Mexico. Like, he out there and said, bitch, I want my 100K. Ain't no 50, you know. Same. Was that like Oso's brother, or what was he? That probably a good friend. Because uh, he was. Of I, I they remember they would they pulled the gun on Oso ass. Yeah. I, I, maybe they were in the same gang when he got shot or something. I don't know. He did something. Yeah, I don't know. It, it's something. But damn, he did. But he didn't have a reaction like his brother got killed. That's why. That's what made me bring that yeah, up. Yeah, no, like, he didn't. Uh, he was know, like, oh. Good guy. Guy. We just thought it should have been like more. Emotional. Yeah, like nigga, that's your brother. Like, I mean, he was. He found the kids was them gone. Word. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, what's the kid at? Like, yeah, they. Had to go uh, check on them. That shit's wild. Yeah, well, he got that bitch fighting. It's Franklin nourishes ship. He stabbed him in the heart. I, that's why I was tripping. Like when he came and the door was already open. Yeah, I don't know why he didn't whistling, instantly like, like grab his strap mm-hmm. like. You know yeah, is. something, yeah, something ain't no right. No, nah, he ain't had a toolie, man. Are we ever going to see the chick again? Maybe. Maybe she gone. Maybe they just wrote her character off because she snitched. And then everybody was like, damn, we don't like this character no more. So they just... Because for all that, I feel like they should have ended that season with her getting shot. And also, you know, Patrick holding her crying... She's just gone. Yeah. I'm guessing she's gonna come back. I think he just episode he eight. Just searching because of that last shitty episode got us. No, no, I'm just asking, like, what happened to the bitch? Like, man, I still want to know what happened with him and Teddy and the recruiter and the motherfucker <laughs> they killed with Andre. So that is, that thing got shit to say with nothing. Do See, somebody got. had put. I think it was OC and uh, on Instagram responded to my post because I put the little uh, meme on there that said, "Well, that sucked," and then I was like. Episode tr- ten was trash to me, and then she said, "Yeah, there was mixed reviews on it, but it was supposed to show you how Franklin' life could have been had he not done some. I don't know. That was her inter- interpretation of that episode or something. I guess that shit's mm-hmm. never been answered. You know what I mean? So, mm-hmm. That's what I'm <laughs> but no, I was just wondering, like, what happened to her? Like, I mean, she so- still got a good out. Okay, she disappeared. Like, we still, she still has a good out." They can, she can come back for whatever reason down the road and say she been doing this, mm-hmm. <laughs> running a church now. Pregnant. Who knows? She you know, but also baby. Oh shit! I'm still confused though. I swear, Andre shot the, the dude. That, that's the real crazy part. <laughs> yeah, but I, I, like I said, I felt like all that was dream shit and whatever. Like well, Andre really did shoot the dude. No, Andre didn't really shoot the dude, man. Unless we've been watching the alternate reality. <laughs> Could have happened. Aliens. This whole show. Aliens. aliens. <laughs> they brought the show. <laughs> Could have happened a while ago. Again. Alternate universe. What you mean it happened a while ago? And then he got out of prison. Nigga, they had him in that a body the nigga, bag. Right? They had him zipped up in a body bag. Yeah, that's the dude. That's that, the dude, yeah, right? That's the dude that raped homeboy. Okay. All right. That fucking uh, Leon ended up killing because Franklin couldn't, couldn't pull the trick. Right. Yeah, that was they that They ran up on Franklin and popped him first. <laughs> Beat him up. I know they probably like, why are they still talking about that fucking okay. episode? <laughs> but hey, we know. still confused about that shit. But yeah. this episode was all right. Um, I can't believe Homeboy almost got Leon and Fatback body trying to run up there with some Mexicans. Do you think they was going to body him or do you think they was really no. just doing a transaction? I don't know, man. Like, because they, like, they, they flashed the lights like they was up there and they wanted them to come up there. Yeah, like they knew but, it was right. So they can get that money. Yeah, but That's then when they didn't come up, 
Them, yeah. I swear them niggas was walking down with AKs walking. and yeah, shit. Yeah. Like, I, and I could have swore I heard like that. I could have swore I heard somebody go. Yeah, I seen the handgun. And I then my I man, I could have swore the one dude. Look, I, I don't know. I don't know. I, don't know. I didn't say it was dark. That same shit that little young boy had issues with. I couldn't <laughs> see. <laughs> Well, you called. There was a car up the street. I didn't even see the car. Uh, in the I thought I seen a little like, back of the car shining or something in mm-hmm. an earlier clip or something. Yeah, but shit. Overall, it was an okay episode. Looking forward to the next one. We're going to go ahead and check on out. If you enjoyed it, bam, hit that thumbs up. Also, make sure to share and subscribe. Let us know in the comment section what you thought. We'll catch y'all later. Salute the general. Homie Joe. Bro. We gone.